HPSC, the black brass, the black Barbie, and I'm back with another video. But before we get started, I do have a couple announcements. So I will put a timestamp on where the actual video will start if you just want to skip. But the announcements are I just turned 19. August 11 was my birthday, so I just turned 19. As you can see, I got my happy birthday sign. And I also have my 19 balloons to show that I turned 19. Also, another announcement is that I am ginger now. Like, look at this. Y'all, like, this color is absolutely popping, okay? I love the way it looks. But, yeah, I will be doing a video on how I did the watercolor method to achieve this color on this wig. So, if you guys want to see, make sure you stay tuned for that because I will be having that video out soon. Uh, but, anyways, I just want to say thank you to everyone that shouted me out on my birthday, that sent me birthday gifts, that sent me money to my cash app. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. And even if you didn't, thank you for subscribing to my channel and being a supporter because I love you so much and I love that you love me. Me. If you guys did not see my pictures for my birthday, make sure you go on my Instagram. I will have everything on my Instagram and you can clearly see my pictures and how cute I look. Oh, I also want to say that I know I've been dropping a lot of hair videos back to back to back, but that's because a lot of companies have been reaching out to me back to back to back. So I don't want you guys to think that this channel is just a hair channel. Like, don't get me wrong. This channel, I love doing hair on it and I will be doing more hair videos. But I don't want you guys to think this channel is just solely for the purpose of hair hair because I do want to drop more videos of you guys seeing my personality and me just talking about different stuff but I haven't really had the chance to do that because I've been having so many hair videos to record but yeah that was it for announcements so let's jump straight into the video so I did ask um, a bunch of people will ask my followers on Instagram and I ask people on snapchat to send in their assumptions about me we're gonna get started with the first one so <laughs> the first one is I think you secretly think that Ashley Elladu is the best person to ever live. I don't know, just a thought. Um, I'm gonna say that's not true, but actually, I'm gonna say it's true to a certain extent. You are one of the best people in my life that I know to exist, but um, girl, you're so conceited. Like, get, get out of my yellow. Get out. Bye. Okay, moving on to the next one. I don't even want to read this. This is so inappropriate. <laughs> Use a sucking fool. Absolutely not. I don't know who this is or whoever wrote this. So whoever wrote this, your mama is one. Okay. So the next one is that you were very popular in high school. So I'm going to say that is a no. I'm an introvert. So I like staying with a group of people that I know got my back and I got theirs. So I'm very picky on who I select to actually hang out with. Did I ever have like a big group of friends that the whole school knew or like that I was just the popular kid? No. If that was the case, I would have I would have ran for prom queen and I probably would have won. But I wish, I wish I was the popular kid in high school. I like go follow me on Instagram. Do this. So like I said, only three people responded on the yellow app on Snapchat. So now we're gonna move into Instagram. So on Instagram, I'm able to see who said this and who didn't. The first one is from nobody nobody at all ashley elladu that you love my thick fat juicy um ashley i don't know why you have an obsession with booty but um <laughs> no no i do not <laughs> no thank you <laughs> nay you dumb and annoying but you my Dumb, never me. And um, annoying. I can see myself being annoying. To certain people, I know I could be annoying. I just know how to get under their skin. If that makes sense. I don't try to, but I mean, if I'm not in the mood and you make me not in the mood, then I'm gonna just make you not in the mood because we finna not be in the mood together. I mean, it's that simple. So, but thank you. Okay, the next one. You a roach. I mean, but if you gonna call me roach, put the baddest in front of it. <laughs> Let me stop playing. But Roach, never that, boo. Never that. that that's you, but that ain't me. That's you. 
but that ain't me. Okay, this ain't really a bad assumption, but I thought you made your own wig. But no, I don't make my own wigs. Um, I buy my wigs. I have did it before in my um watercolor fail video. I do see why people make their wigs because they definitely can make it 10 times more fuller than just buying it from a wig company and then putting how many bundles they want in it. So no, I don't make my own wigs. I wish I had the time to, but um I just buy them because anybody got time. I ain't got time for that. The next one. I am kind, beautiful, smart, motivated. I just wish you would try to answer when I text. Aw, thank you so much. Y'all, I know this is not an excuse, but to me, it's an excuse. But, I mean, you just have to be in my shoes to see where I'm coming from. I am an introvert, so I'm going to explain to you how I am. This may seem really weird. Like, sometimes I just don't feel like texting people, if that makes sense. Like, you know how sometimes when your phone be dry and you wish people would text you? Well, I would say I'm that way, but the opposite way. And my best friends, I don't do that with them because I'm really close to them. But just like with associates or just like people that I don't really talk to on a daily basis, texting and stuff, eh. I may get a notification that somebody texted me and I won't open it till like maybe two hours later. Just depending on how I feel because I don't know why. Like, I just feel like when I text somebody, it takes the energy out of me. Like, I don't, I know it sounds crazy. I know it'd be like, girl, you sound selfish. <laughs> I'm really trying not to. So, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but I hope that didn't sound bad. So, yeah. Okay, so the next one, I already know who this is from. This is from my best friend's little sister, Maya. She said, hey, y'all Camilla. If y'all don't know, that's my little nickname that they gave me. I assume that you are shorter than me. You know what, little girl? I'm gonna let it slide. I'm gonna finally admit it. Maya you are taller than me i'm 19 i'm still 5'2 and it seemed like she taller than me already so i will admit it my i am shorter than you here you want your cookie okay the next one you exclusive i mean what you mean by exclusive like do you mean that like i'm different do you mean exclusive as in like oh you single do you mean exclusive as like you know i'm diversion uh, oh excuse me but exclusive um maybe maybe not i mean maybe i am exclusive maybe i'm not exclusive the next one says you look like you're chill and not with all the drama that is true <laughs> chill I'm chill with people I don't know or not that comfortable with but I'm extra with people I'm close with and I do know and I'm not with all the drama now that is true but am I here for the drama yes because I do like getting tea now you can sit up here and judge me all you want but we know good and well some people like seeing drama now I'm not the type of person that's gonna go out and start it but best believe if somebody be like oh girl I got some tea to tell you I'm going to step <laughs> I'm going to huh oh what was that she did what <gasps> she said that yeah baby I'm gonna I'm gonna be all here for her. I'm gonna be all open ears I'll be like what was that really oh my god I'm sorry I'm not gonna sit up here lying to y'all <laughs> okay for the next one I was gonna screenshot this one because the words did get cut off so the person said I didn't have any other than that you seem really quiet but yeah I would definitely say I am a quiet person um especially like in a new setting in a new environment um I will talk if you talk to me of course I'm gonna talk back but I am a type of person where I do protect my energy I believe in energy and I feel like if I get bad vibes from you or something's off or something in my instinct or spirit is telling me that you know to really watch you or stay away from you type thing then that's what I'm gonna do but um if something in my spirit is telling me like oh this person is very open person this person is very nice you know you could trust them you're very comfortable with this person then and of course i'm going to talk to you all right the next one says you have specific playlists for different moods that is completely true especially when i'm riding in my car because i get to put on my playlist and it just depends on what mood i'm in like i'm telling you i could be like you know in my feelings i'll probably put on some summer walker you know some slow jams i could be like hype turn i might put on some cash doll yes that is definitely true i do have a different playlist for all my different moods 
Okay, another one is um that my sis will forever be cute. Period. But yes, this is true. I will forever be cute, sis. You will forever be cute. And I love that you said that. But yes, sis. I mean, pretty girls gotta stick together. Come on. Okay, and the very last assumption about me is whoo, you're a very beautiful young lady, but you look like you've been hurt before. <laughs> yeah, I would have to say that's definitely true. Thank you for calling me a beautiful young lady. But, um, yes, I will say I have been hurt before. My heart has gotten crushed. But I will say God is good. And let's just say everything worked out. And that person that did hurt me did reach back out to me and apologize so like i said i mean everything was every i'm cool like i ain't got no beef with this person i moved on i'm doing great i'm doing fine will i ever do a story time on that maybe maybe not i don't know but yeah y'all that was it that was everything that was all the assumptions you guys had about me if y'all want to see me do another one of these videos feel free don't forget to follow me on instagram and snapchat but definitely instagram because if you follow me on there um i noticed that more people answer on there but you can also follow me on snapchat too and i'll see your answers too but that was it for this video that was just me basically answering all the assumptions that you guys had about me and stuff and yeah this video was actually really fun to do like i actually really enjoyed it thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe because we need to get this video popping anyways i will be seeing you guys in another video real soon bye